everyone. Happy New Year. This month's topic is uh, feeding your dog nutrition. So I want to share some tips with you that I've learned and um, to remind you to only use by nature pet food products. Just kidding. They are the best though. That's what we use. Our dog loves them. Um, portion control. The best thing you can do for portion control is to use a measuring cup. You can portion it out very easily. We use a, a single one cup measuring cup and uh, that's how we do our dry food. We feed our dog twice a day so he gets a cup in the morning, cup in the afternoon with a half a can of wet food in the afternoon. But well, we've learned some tricks along the way because um, feeding should be fun time too and to um, distract him a little bit while we're eating dinner we do some different things with his food so it takes him a little bit longer. So one of the things I do is I fill these hollow marrow bones, they're, I can hear they're hollow, um, with his wet food. Sometimes I'll mix it with a little bit of kibble. But we fill it with his wet food and we freeze them. So when it's time for him to eat, he gets to eat and also kind of stay busy and, and have fun working at it. And it gives us a little more time and peace. Um, you can also fill these with uh, non-flavored yogurt, just plain yogurt. They really like that. And give it to him during the day for a snack, for something to do. And peanut butter too. And also peanut butter. You sometimes you use peanut butter. You can also fill the kongs, like a kong with these types of things. Or a smaller, smaller one of these hollow bones. And so we just, once, once they're filled, we wrap them in plastic. And we freeze them. We, we always have. We always keep a bunch of these in the freezer for him to um, to eat or snack on. So that's one thing. Um, when we give him treats, treats are great. These are also by nature. Um, these are the blueberry flavor, I think, and he loves these. But one of the things that's kind of fun to do is to break them up and hide them in his toys. And this is something that he likes to, then he can go find them. And that's a lot of fun for him. The other thing you can do with the treats that we found fun is when you have these little toys that they, the dogs end up chewing holes in, is hiding some treats in here. And also making a game out. So, these are some nice options. Instead of just putting your dog's food in his bowl um, to make it interesting for him and, and to, to give yourself some more time when you're busy trying to put your own dinner together. Okay. Um, so, sit, 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 down, down. Good boy. You can see how much our dog loves his by nature pet food, but particularly when it's hidden in this fun little bone for him to search in. It just makes it more fun for them. So to sum up, uh, the lesson for this month about nutrition is to stay consistent with your portions by using measuring cups and make it fun for your dog by coming up with um, new and fun ways to feed them. So in bones and toys and you can do that both with their food, their snack and, and some other things.